Hi everyone, welcome to Angel Heart Wisdom. I am Lavinia and I'm here with your December 2016 reading. If you're new to my channel, thank you for being here. I also want to thank you for your loyal support and your best wishes. Continue to like, share and subscribe and show your love. For a personal reading with me, visit my website www.angelheartwisdom444.wibbly.com but can purchase your readings, email your questions to angelheartwisdom444 at gmail.com Capricorn welcome to this month's reading I will be using the butterfly oracle by Doreen as well as a variation of my virtual decks to provide your messages for this month we start off with retirement support seeking and finding and parental care Mm. So retirement, rest, reflection, recuperation, rejuvenation, um, heart-centered communication, as well as trusting the inner self. For some, this could be you retiring, no need to strive, no need to work, weaning yourself off a nine to five and finding a hobby that supports your heart, that you're being guided to take up at this point in time to assist you in getting the bills paid for others this could be you looking after retired loved ones a family or friends retirement rest reflection rejuvenation recuperation support you're being asked to support the self to support others okay um really trust your internal guidance system internal communication with the self while being able to see things clearly for those of you who have been doing everything on your own know that the support is there the support that you need is there ask for it okay ask for it from your team spiritually and physically you have the support that you need at this point in time so don't be afraid to ask for the support that you need you don't have to go it alone you really don't have to go it alone this month okay the support is there ask for it and pay attention to um, inner feelings as you being guided by your spiritual team as to what to do next this month because you're seeking and finding um, this is a call to really look within you're wanting to know what to do next with the next phase of your manifestation work and you're being asked to look within prayer meditation call on your spiritual team for that support and guidance that you need it is available to you this month okay all in all i'm feeling that it's not a month where you need to strive and push forward and do you know um run about the only thing that you may be doing is running around getting christmas gifts um, putting up your tree um, decorating your home if you're into that kind of thing but this is a month where you focus on the light within really connect with the spiritual side of the self okay um as the time favors this this is a time of um, Christ consciousness, universal oneness, seeing the bigger picture and really finding compassion within the heart for yourself and others this month. Um, parental care. This could be you needing care, you the parent needing care or you providing care to your parents, your elderly parents your who are no longer able to provide care for themselves at this point in time. Okay, parental care. Um, really again trusting the self being able to see things clearly while remaining rather grounded in the physical yeah and being willing to head into the unknown parental care when this card comes up for me I get both of my parents you know they need some assistance I need to do this for them I need to go somewhere with them I need to assist them with something or the other so parental care is in strong focus it could be you or your parents needing care this month yeah retired parents needing care but provide that support and look within for the answers that you seek as to what to do next I'm gonna go on to the um, life coaching Oracle for you for the next set of your messages
speak up self-love and the void yeah so the situation for the entire month is for you to speak up yeah your soul is guiding you to stand in your light and speak your truth speak up you cannot stay quiet anymore okay this will not be allowed your intuition is asking you your soul is asking you to speak up stand in your light and speak your truth no longer allow yourself to be placed in situations that does not serve you it could be speaking up for yourself or speaking up for someone who does not have a voice at this point in time are your words scripted do you only say what you think others want to hear? Your soul is guiding you to stand in your light and speak up. You have something important to say. Speak up, guys. Speak up. Yeah, that is the only way you could change things. Okay, speak up. And emotionally, you're being asked to focus on loving the self. Yeah, what's and all loving the self because if you cannot love yourself once and all don't think anybody will be able to love you okay you gotta focus on the self love yourself okay once and all be appreciative of everything within you that makes you this unique creation of a great king okay love yourself you're learning that your capacity to love is directly related to your ability to love yourself if you can't love yourself Mm -mm. it would be hard for others to love you so love yourself yeah stay grounded and love the self love yourself look within know yourself on a soul level know who you really are know why you're here at this point in time understand your differences what makes you unique a unique individual okay that mole that what you know the color of your hair this is what makes you special Okay, so by seeking and finding, by looking within, you are able to unfold your true self and love it. Love him, her, what's and all, no matter what. Love yourself. Um, there's a void. There's a void, you know, a void. Feeling that um, you've lost something. Feeling that you're missing something. There's a void. And you may be covering this void through drugs, alcohol, addictions. Be careful. Okay? You may be covering up the emptiness or pain through an addiction. There is a void. Okay? Pay attention. And be guided accordingly. Yeah? With this void. Barking dog. Good sign. Okay? The void. Release no smoking, no drinking, whatever this means to you. Yeah, but no judgment. Speak up, love yourself once and all. Whether you have an addiction or whatever, try to release it slowly but surely. And they're saying that parental care it might be you needing care. You really needing care, but there's a void. Yeah, focus, know that, and don't be led, you know, to abuse certain substances okay this month let's see which guardian angel you could call on to assist you in releasing this void or addiction or or to really assist you this month in loving yourself more and we have archangel ariel and she's saying move forward move forward with joy and love okay this energy could assist and bringing all good things to you laughing having fun and tis the season to be jolly okay so move forward with the joy and love find people who support you who don't judge you you know and um focus on loving the self what's and all no matter what people say about you speak up for yourself speak up for your needs speak up for others if you need to of high vib vibrational messages and energies surround you this month let's go to your message from god's promises through impatience so some of you might be impatient this month things may not be progressing as fast as you would like it to but just be patient. My soul waits for the Lord more than those who watch for the morning. Yes, more than those who watch for the morning. Psalms 130 verse 6. Okay, wait patiently 
on the lawn. Let me know how those messages resonated. Remember, like, share, and subscribe for a personal reading with me. Check out the links in the description box below. Have an amazing month. See ya.